we are going to make a Naka error series like 4412 in Creo parametric. So for that we need to get the points from the Excel sheet. So I have uploaded this file in the description. You can see the link. From there you can download it also. Opening it. Now you can see here it is 4412. So just copying the upper coordinates, right? Top coordinates, okay. Above the reference line. So pasting it in a random or a empty file of that okay and now here deleting the last coordinates and placing here one zero and zero this is x this is y and this is z right now copying this all going here making a new text document in that pasting it right and saving it as so here for make for the usability in creo we need to add the extension called pts and save as all files so creo will automatically detect the file extension here okay saved again you can see it is saved in this like here and this is a one a random file so just delete one all this going again take, taking the lower coordinates below the reference line coordinates and now pasting it again it here deleting the last coordinates and placing one zero zero so for the follow the same procedure is copying this all copy and now pasting here in this blank document i will just put it first and save as so as a bottom dot pts getting a all files saving it as a all files saved right so for this we have done our work of creating a points now going in the creo now selecting one plane sketching it align now here just made one reference line i'm choosing a construction mode here okay uh, giving the dimension as one i can you can see it is zoom so far and now creating spline uh just going off from the construction mode and now taking spline from the center the n right again right i'm taking just a reference this spline making a spline over here now uh, making one coordinate point coordinate system at the center of this okay you can see it is displayed over here now double click on this without going out of the sketch okay now going to files take the uh, um, now coordinate system this one cartesian system open that top file i'm just going there top one import points okay you can see the points are developed here okay And now selecting the downward thing selecting the coordinates opening that file bottom pts of import you can see the airfoil is done here so it's perfect airfoil 
Naka 4412 profile okay with the perfect points here right now extruding it no no first of all if you need to um, if you need to get more chord length you just need to put here 100 you can see it is chord length is extended as per the points also we can be extended like 120 so it's like that only okay so just now extruding it to the like uh, 500 symmetric extension right it's now developed thanks for watching